Okay, the next step is going to be to tie our tail onto our fly now that we have our thread started. So, we're going to use these little iridescent green feathers from the wing, or iridescent green um, barbules from the wing of a uh, peacock. So to start, we're going to need to wrap our thread to the back of the hook, right there where the bend starts. And you want to work when you want when you're wrapping near to the point of the hook. You want to make sure you wrap at an angle like this, so that you don't nick your nick your thread or cut it on the barb or the point. All right, now that we're back at the point at the just where the hook bends, we're going to give it a few extra wraps to give it a little bump there to help hold our feathers uh, a little higher so that the tail will stick up just a little bit like the tail on a bug does. Right. If you look, I'm just building up this little bit of bump right here. It takes a couple of wraps to do it with thread this, this thing. Right. Now that we've got that done, we take our tail feathers, get them all nice and lined up right there. We don't want these to be really long since our hook is kind of short, so we're going to start them with the tips all the way at the eyes and then we'll cut off the excess. So we just get the ends of the feather right there at the end. Right. So I'm going to hold that at a 45 degree angle and just as I tighten this down I'm going to let the feathers slip around the hook until they're right to the point that I want them to be, just like that. And I'm going to make a couple, two or three wraps with a thread, hold them nice and tight. And we're just going to let the bobbin hang, pick up my scissors, and I'm going to trim off the excess. Just be right like that. And then we have our tail attached to our fly. 